Hello, happy Halloween. If you're wondering why this picture is so low in the ground, it's because last week, Leslie and I had our first homeowner horror story. Let me explain. It's this time of the year that it's not like super hot and it's not also super cold which is good but Luna loves this time because she she doesn't have to be inside of the apartment all the time with the AC now she just like she's outside enjoying this nice weather right Luna We just go for a little walk around the parking lot. Big walks for Luna are at night. It's colder, it's not as hot. Like, I mean, it's not totally hot right now, but we also wait for Leslie to arrive home. That way we can all go together to downtown. Luna's ready, so let's just take her up. Dehumidifier. Dehumidifier, dehumidifier, air scrubber, 500. So it's just a fan. But the thing is like, there's so many of these things. Like look, one, two, three, four. So these big machines, they've been running for 24 seven now. They're so freaking loud. Okay, so if you're not familiar with this dehumidifying machines, you're so lucky. If you do know them, you already know what is behind this picture. But in case you don't know, let me show it to you. Oh. I'm gonna tell you everything about this story, but first, I need to get out of this place. Check that view. So, uh, what happened, everything was going well at Perez Green HQ when all of a sudden I was doing the dishes and Leslie and I, we were talking while we were doing the dishes and all of a sudden like the floor, you know whenever you step on like a wet sponge that you just like press on it and all the, all the bubbles come up, exactly like that. Uh, we thought at the beginning that it was the um, dishwasher But then we wait for everything to dry it out a little bit. It wasn't totally dry and The moment that we start using the sink again, there was water everywhere. So we have to call a plumber Wow A plumber came in and then all of a sudden I have this huge parade of people in my house like there was first the guy first it was the plumber then it was the guy from the water mitigation then was the water mitigation with the actual dehumidifiers the one that you saw uh, at the building then it was another guy doing the the kind of like the restoration to see if like because we thank god i listened to leslie and we got an insurance because uh they're gonna come and apparently they're gonna fix the floor I got a call today, they say that yeah, we need to go there and we probably need to start the order to remove the floor. So that's something pretty good that came out of it. But it was so stressful having all these people in the house coming in every day. There's one guy that comes every day to check on the humidifier. I don't know, that's crazy. But hopefully tomorrow those things will are gone 
and everything comes back to normal because we've been eating for a week inside of our bedroom because those things need to be on all the time I turn it off for the video but they need to be on all the time it's freaking crazy now I realize that after saying all this, it sounds like a total baby because at the end of the day, they're gonna probably gonna change our floor, so that's pretty good. But I feel like probably it's because I've been stuck in the house for so long. I mean, there's people coming all day. So today, I just wanna use the day to go out, get some workout done, and kind of like release some stress. So let's go ahead and do that. Now it's time for a workout. All right, those were 20 stairs, five sprints. I'm really not a good sprinter, but I feel good. It's time to go to the house. I need to check up on Luna.